Good morning, everyone. Uh, let me give you a little backstory here. So, Baguio City has its own share of festivals in the Philippines, and we call this the Panagbanga Festival or the Baguio Flower Festival. Now, this is being celebrated for the whole month of February, and sometimes it extends through the first week of March at least. Now, <clears throat> the first day of February, the city kicks off the celebration with a parade which uh, goes around the main streets of uh, the central business district and followed by different programs and activities, of course. Now, the two main attractions of this, uh, of this uh, festival are the Grand Street Parade, uh, which happens actually two days in a row, and of course the uh, Session Road in Bloom. Okay, so what happens is that the, right after the Grand Street Parades, the whole stretch of Session Road is being closed and filled up with different stalls where people can buy some sort of different products and services which are open up until 12 midnight. And that happens for the whole week. That's right there happening behind me. The Session Road in Bloom has been happening for a while now and year after year they're kind of pretty much showing the same thing. So please correct me if I'm wrong. I think the main purpose of this uh, sort of trade fair is to kind of showcase the different products and services of the locals here in Baguio City and of course the neighboring provinces uh, or Benguet as a whole. I think that the things that we should be expecting here are the things that are unique to the city or the stuff that are found only here in Baguio City or in Benguet as a whole. So it should be a showcase of lifestyle and tradition of the people here in Baguio City. Just like when you want to know more about the Visayan tradition, then you try to indulge yourself in their uh, own festival. Same is through here. So when people come to visit Baguio City, uh, especially at the Spanish Bank, uh, the stalls or the things that they should be looking at here should tell or kind of tell the story about the people of Benguet, right? And we have to admit that not all of these stalls that we have here right now are uh, doing their purpose. So what I want to do right now is to roam around and check whether or not the stalls here really deserve a spot here at the Session Road in Bloom. So again, this is just my own opinion, which everybody is, uh, I mean, has a right on. So you have your own opinion, I have mine, so please don't judge me on this, okay? just is not to discredit the other stalls here is that we're just trying to highlight the, the stalls that we think deserves the spot here and uh, um, in this festival just like this, this stall right here you see these it promotes the products that are being made with the people uh, nearby Benguet
itaw ni Swan Mori. Kung tingnan mo yung uh, uh, ground floor pa rin, Oh, absolutely, these are products being made by the people here in Vatican City. So yes, absolutely, you deserve a spot here. So I've run around this corner and this is so far my favorite. Look at how creative the people here. This should be showcased from from everywhere. Ray-Ban for 150. 